Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and tonight's video is really the second part of this video, and I'm going to explain why you would want to convert an outline to an object. So we've got a black circle. We're going to take our ellipse tool. I still call it the circle tool, and we're just going to make kind of a ellipse. We're going to hit P in the C, P, P on the keyboard. Now we're going to make this ellipse a little thicker. And we're going to turn it white. Whoop. Left click. Now, I'm going to make a complete copy of this. Control D. Okay, these are both equal. I'm going to take this one and go up to a range, convert to an object. So it says curve on one layer. This says ellipse on one layer. Now we're going to take five of these. So Control D. Rotate it 72 degrees again, again, again. This one we're going to rotate. We need to make a duplicate. Control D. We're going to rotate it 72 degrees. So these are both equal, right? Well, no, they're not. So if we take all this and we go up to the trim tool, we get exactly what we wanted. You can see through it, it's transparent. Our garbage is still here. But this would engrave good. Now, we're going to do the same thing here. We're going to hit trim. Look at the difference. So when you want those inner parts, you need to convert it to an object. Same thing even if you weld this. It just all goes away. Anyway, hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.